Hi, in this video we'll be showing you how to set the display status of your website when using the free viral traffic generator tool. If you haven't registered your website yet, use the link under this video or visit the following website www.a2zidx.com the purpose of this quick and easy step is to verify that the registered website can be displayed to visitors. Registration mistakes happen even to the most experienced web users. For example, a simple typo in the website address or other errors could mean that a registered website is not displayed, making all your efforts pointless. Once you've confirmed that your website is displayed on your viral website landing page, it will be available to visitors. In most cases, all that is required is to check that the website is displayed and to select the display status. If your registered website doesn't display, check the following. Is there a typing error in the website address provided? Or does the website have a coding error? Or is there a problem on the server? Or is there a problem communicating with the server? Or are you promoting a website that is no longer available? Or does the website include coding to stop embedding? Setting the display status of your website is done on your viral website landing page when you're logged in. If you are registering a new website, you will automatically be taken to your viral website landing page as part of your registration confirmation process. Here you can confirm your website is displayed correctly. Updating your website display status is also required whenever the registered website address is changed. You can change the display status at any time by logging in and then hovering over your area or tapping on a mobile and then selecting share your website landing page from the sub menu. Please note your viral website landing page like a number of other pages on this site are dynamic and some information is only displayed under certain conditions. For example the additional sections covered here are only displayed when the logged in user is viewing one of their own website registrations. There may also be a few differences between the video shown and what you see on your screen. For example, if you have registered just one website or multiple websites, your website display status is set in the section headed Update the display status of your website if required. Under the heading is the currently selected website and its display status. If you have registered more than one website, this will be followed by a section headed Change the website for which you want to set the display status if required. If you do want to change to a different registration, select the website in the field headed Select the website for which you want to set the display status and then click on the Change button. This will change to the selected website and refresh the page. Scroll down to see if your website is displayed immediately below. Then scroll back up to your website display status field. There are three display options. 1. Your website is displayed below. 2. Display a button linking to your website. Or 3. Do not display this website. If your website is displayed on the page, ensure that your website is displayed below is selected. If not, select this option and click on the Update button to change the setting and refresh the page. The display status of the current website should then indicate OK. 
Your website will then be displayed to the public on your viral website landing page and will be available to all your visitors using your viral website self-promoting links and banners. It will also be displayed to anyone registering in your downline levels 1 to 6. Your viral downline levels 2 to 6 are where all your new free viral traffic is generated. If your website isn't displayed on the page, click on your website address under the Select the Display Status of your website heading, which will open in a new window. If your website is then displayed, select Display a button linking to your website and click on the Update button. This will provide a button that visitors can click on to display your website in a new window. Please see the Frequently Asked Questions page for our recommended alternatives to this. If your website isn't displayed in a new window, when you click on your website address, either the registered website address is invalid or the website is not available. Try the following. Visit your website and if it displays, copy the entire website address from your browser address bar, including the HTTP or HTTPS part, and then change the registered website address on your settings page. Then refresh this page and check that your website is now displayed. If you can't display your website, even in a new window, there is some other problem. Check the following. 1. Is the registered website address invalid? Or 2. Does the website have a coding error? Or 3. Is there a problem on the server? Or 4. Are you promoting a website that is no longer available? Or 5. Is there a problem communicating with the server? If resolving this is not something you can do, you'll need to ask for some help as the problem is related to your website. If you're promoting an affiliate program, Check the affiliate link is correct and that the affiliate program is still available. Contact the product owner for help if required. If it isn't the website address, we suggest that you contact your internet service provider as there may be a technical fault on the server.